potatoes going potate, taters going tate, and haters going hate. So today we're doing a walking food tour. It's two and a half hours long and we're walking basically with a guide and trying food. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of people with dogs here and dogs that walk on leash, dogs that walk off leash. So I'll show you guys a whole bunch of dogs. So we started off with chiquetti, which are Venetian local finger foods, and these are shrimp and crab sandwiches. Then we had Venetian artichoke, which is braised and then has olive oil and pepper on it, and I highly recommend this, it was really good. Then we went to a little pastry shop that is also a cafe that has been owned for over 50 years now by the Mauro family, being passed down from generation to generation. And they're really known for their puff pastries. This is a puff pastry that has caramel in it, and the pastry sheets are like layered, and they basically crumble when you bite. It tastes exactly like those palm olive pretzel things. Then we had creamed cod fish on top of fried polenta. And then a whole fried baby octopus also on top of fried polenta with some parsley. The place we went to get this is Aqua e Maiz. <laughs> then we had little sandwiches with all kinds of garnishes on them that even had salami, different cheeses, olive paste, and my favorite was this tomato and pepper spread with a baby octopus on it. And we saw a rumored real Basquiat painting. Then we went to get some gelato, which had a lot of traditional flavors. The place that we went to is called Il Doge, and they even have a flavor for the doge. Crema del Doge. With um, cream, dark chocolate, and orange. Candied oranges. So we finished our food tour, it was very We finished our food tour, it was very good. Our tour guide was great, Anna. And so now we decided to go get some drinks. So I got Prosecco and Cosina got a Bellini. And I guess it's custom that you get chips whenever you order an alcoholic drink at in the evening basically. So we're gonna enjoy. One sliver of coconut is one euro, 96 cents. So this is pretty good. It literally has no flavor, um, but I don't really like coconut as much. So I'm only taking a few bites and letting her eat the rest because she loves it, but it, it's not bad.